Spiritual ascension or a deep spiritual transformation can sometimes lead to isolation from others due to several factors. 1. Change in priorities. As individuals embark on a spiritual journey, their priorities often shift. They may prioritize personal growth, self-discovery, and inner peace over social interactions and external pursuits. 2. Different interests. The interests and activities that come with spiritual growth may diverge from those of friends and family. For example, someone might prefer meditation and solitary reflection over social gatherings or entertainment. 3. Heightened sensitivity. Spiritual ascension can make people more sensitive to energies and environments, causing discomfort in crowded or negative spaces, leading them to seek solitude. 4. Seeking solitude. Spiritual practices often require solitude for deep introspection and meditation, which can limit time spent with others. But Changing belief systems. Spiritual growth may lead to changes in beliefs and values, potentially creating rifts with friends and family who don't share these beliefs. Emotionally dealing with the isolation that can come with spiritual ascension can be challenging. But here are some strategies to help. 1. Communication. It's crucial to communicate openly with loved ones about your spiritual journey. Help them understand your changes and the importance of this journey in your life. 2. Set boundaries. Establish clear boundaries between your spiritual practices and social life. Ensure you communicate when you need alone time and when you're available for social interactions. 3. Seek like-minded communities. Connect with others who share your spiritual interests. Joining spiritual or meditation groups can help you feel less isolated and provide a support network. 4. Practice self-care. Make self-care a priority, ensuring you take care of your emotional and mental well-being. This will help you maintain balance and resilience. But Respect differences. Understand that not everyone will resonate with your spiritual journey, and that's okay. Respect their choices and differences as you want them to respect yours. 6. Stay open to connection. Keep the lines of communication open with friends and family, even if you're on different paths. Try to find common ground and maintain connections where possible. 7. Acceptance. Accept that isolation can be a part of the spiritual journey, but it doesn't mean you're alone or unloved. It's a period of growth and self-discovery, and it will evolve over time. Remember that while spiritual ascension may lead to some isolation, it can also lead to a deeper understanding of oneself and the world, ultimately enhancing your ability to connect with others in more meaningful ways.